Hello everyone, this is Anush from Prime Investor. Welcome back to another video. In our series of personal finance videos, this is the second chapter. In this chapter, we are planning to cover different goal plans and how do you use Prime Investor calculators to easily identify what amount of SIP you need to be doing or starting to do to achieve your goals. These goals can be anything, it can be uh, to buy a house or buy a car or even uh, planning your education cost for your children. This will be the continuation of the previous video which was on retirement. Uh, in case you haven't watched that video, I'll mark the link here, you can go back and watch it later. First let us understand uh, why SIP to achieve your goals. Basically SIP is nothing but systematic investment plan. Uh, we get our salaries on a monthly basis. So doing investments or savings on a monthly basis is also practical. So that is the main reason why uh, we recommend you to do SIPs. Based on different goals, uh, we have arrived at a couple of calculators which you can use uh, for your better understanding on where your SIPs will get you. So let's get into those calculators now. So log into primeinvestor.in under the useful link section you will find the calculators. As you all know we have a number of calculators. Uh, in today's video we are going to look into the goal based calculator. Uh, if you go to this any goal SIP could get you there. This is the one of the most powerful calculators available here. Okay let's say I want to buy a house during my retirement. Mm, cost of buying a house is about 1 crore today. In my locality so based on your locality it might change how many number of years are remaining uh, 27 now at 60 I retire so about 33 years remaining this inflation uh, this inflation is the uh, inflation based on the goal which you have planned so right now we are planning for a house so it should be the real estate uh, inflation uh, say suppose you're planning for a car, it will be different. Say suppose you're planning for uh, uh, some other electronic gadget or uh, or an international travel, uh, inflation rates will change based according to that. So this inflation is about 4% and what is the expected returns from my investment? So I might not be doing the uh, same kind of investment for the entire tenure. I might be doing a fully equity now and later I might change to a debt plus equity model. And as and when I near my goal, I might even choose to be going full debt. So on average, let us say I'm generating 13.5% as returns. So here you go. The estimated future goal amount is about 3.6 crores. Which my is 1 crore house, which I'm planning to get, will be about 3.6 crores in the future. And my monthly investment needed will be about 4,000 949 rupees so like this we also have one more calculator which is the education goal calculator uh, say suppose you're planning for your kids uh, higher education which is costing about uh, 5 lakhs or say 10 lakhs today and uh, current value of investment i don't have any investment right now and assuming that your kid is say five years old and you will need the money when the kid turns 18 so you have another 13 years uh, education inflation uh, differs from place to place uh, i'm from chennai so here is it about seven percent and uh, what kind of returns i'm expecting it is again a flexible amount so i'm assuming it to be 12.5 percent so the future value of the education cost will be somewhere around 24 lakhs and uh, the amount to be planned is for that because I don't have any investments right now. So the monthly investment SIP which I need to do for this education goal is about 6,220. So like this using our any goal calculator and also your education goal calculator you can plan for your different goals. Not just these calculators we do have a variety of other offerings. We do have stock, mutual fund and ETF recommendations. We also have a variety of other articles in different topics. Uh, now that we have seen how much SIP you need to do for your different goal plans, uh, you can use the ready to use portfolios to figure out 
in which mutual fund you can start investing the said SIP amount. And we have segregated different portfolios based on different needs. Uh, for example, if you go to the aspirational based portfolios, you have uh, different aspirational things such as uh, uh, children wedding, uh, children's education, uh, your vacation or uh, people will just want to be wealthy. So all different types of uh, portfolios are available in the prime portfolio section. So do check out primeinvestor.in. So that's it guys. Hope you like the video. If you really like the video, do give it a like, share and subscribe. Uh, the next part of the personal finance video is going to be on term insurance. How much term insurance do you need? And how do you use our term insurance calculator to effectively calculate it and uh, find out the best term insurance policy available in the market today. See you all in the next video.